morning, everybody. It's Cody Nelson here with Cover Crop Kings. It is eight below right now. It is Christmas Eve, and just wanted to do a couple things. One, wanted to wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Two, wanted to show you what we got going on over here. We are grazing some cows out on some cover crops. Last night, we had up to 60 mile an hour wind gusts here south of River Falls, and we did have some cows push through the fence, but I want to show you a couple things on some cows right now. We just got them back in. We got half of them. The other herd is up here, and I'm, they're facing the north right now. <clears throat> And if you see that grove, uh, that windbreak there, that's where the cows should have been. It wouldn't have been great, but it would have been okay. Uh, but I, wanted, I want you to look at these cows right now. These are the ones that were out. Uh, they just pushed through a gate down on the southeast corner. Remember, we had a northwest wind, so cows are naturally going to go against the wind. Notice how the cows are clean. Clean cows are very, very important this time of year. Uh, they got good hair coats up here in, in the northern plains. We got to have a thick hide and a good hair coat going into winter. And, and why it's so important to have some flesh going on to win winter too. Now the last few, the last few weeks, these cows have really put on a lot of pounds, and that's since we weaned the calves. And you know, different than we did last year, we weaned the calves, put the cows out on these cover crops. Now you can see they're going. Um, they're going to get out of the wind and see the cows down there that when I when I got here this morning uh, those cows were all huddled up down in the southeast corner and they were all piled up in the corner there's a three wire gate on the one side and that top wire had broke off and no doubt that's where these cows got out so anyways we just said to get them across the highway get them back in I just want to show you that uh, give you that tidbit on them cows what to look at when you're looking at cows and, and uh, especially beef cows and if you're trying to put them out in the elements those cows are, are much healthier in this situation i mean it's cold out here no doubt about it but those cows are much healthier than being in a barn and and especially cows that get in and out uh, generally you'll see those cows being very dirty and them cows will get in and sweat up then they come back out and, and they get sick when they go outside so anyways just wanted to show you that um this is not bad weather. Cows are meant to be in this. I wish we had better wind protection for sure, but they do if you can push them there. Next time, what I'm gonna probably do, I hate to feed the hay while the cows are on cover crops, but I think what we'll do is we'll feed them up in that spot just to keep them out of the weather. So, hey, you guys have a Merry Christmas.